Greetings everyone, this is BJ Black from No Export For You and welcome to part 125 of my Let's Play of Ama Yui Castle Meister. So, I'm already into it, so here I am fighting the battle. We just defeated General Farble, or whatever her title was. It was some complicated thing. Oh, Mikshan is out of spell points. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Funny, they aren't counter-attacking. Oh, look at that. Lightning and lightning. So, they can't hurt. They can't hurt Ronin at all. Oh, nominally. take a look at who's lowest on life and it's counting over there but actually it's better when he's low on life I made improvement to the mouse click sounds. You may have noticed already. So I click on and click out. There's a bit of a sound when I drag around. Oh, how frustrating. Mm, yeah, this will work. Okay, fine. Oops. Was she really that badly injured? Yeah, she really was. Oh, sure. Okay, soften her up a bit, so Mikshan can swoop in for the kill. No. <sighs> well, at least I got a capture out of it. All right. Don't 
time for us to get in there and fight coup de vance and a couple of elven archers. You know what? I haven't done this in a while. Here we go. Oh, hmm. Alright, you people who obey the taboo goddess. Kudvans here, the high priest of the Fuchsia faith, will quiet you along with the castle. So, Avaro thought when he first met Kudvance that he wasn't the type who would just attack us because we are taboo. And he was happy for that at the time. But now he's giving this lame excuse for destroying the castle instead, so... We're gonna make you regret that. <laughs> excuse huh in that case try and overcome the unfairness of the world so the intention was to do this at the holy accord but even though this the castle is a taboo he planned to turn it to Good use for the Fuchsia faith. Huh, wonder what kind of plans that was. Oh wait, he wasn't planning on that, he was planning on this. In any case... So, now that we know what's going on with him, we don't really need to talk much. But, anyway, we're going to defeat you. Everybody? Oh crap. I guess Kudvance isn't affected by that. Uh, only plus two def Hmm, really I thought this was pretty powerful. Yeah, you'd be looking at 67. Oh, I bet he has magic reduction. Yeah, it's right here. Level 3 magic reduction as well. I bet that goes going to wave up though. Come on, man. Alright, next step. I actually have a few turns to do this. Whew. He has lightning, earth, and non-elemental attacks available. The earth attack is an area of effect attack. Hmm. Actually, let's just wait for this next guy to come back in this next turn. Uh, come on. You're practically dead, guy. Huh, okay, fine. I figured he'd rush us now that he's, you know, half dead. 
But his AI is stuck on, hey, stand here and look stupid. All right. This is probably a bad idea, but I'm going all in. <laughs> Look at that. Fia got paralyzed. Oh, that kind. Oh, man. That hurt. Okay. Wait a minute. This guy didn't even do anything. Kudvance did his thing and... This guy didn't. Strange. Well, whatever. Oh yes, I unsummoned him and he healed. Now I got to keep in mind that I want to defeat Kudvance with the full meal for double items. But also remember... Hmm. She does a bit too much damage. Hmm, let's just do this. Now, the safest place would be right here where Mikshuana is standing. Kudvance will still make attacks, but... Well, it's better than standing in the range of his area of effect attack. Oh, great. Looks like I should have healed her up. Oh, one of these guys is going to attack. Only doing significant damage because of anti-air effect. Oh man. Now. He has a lightning attack, and a very powerful one. So he can get through... Kamin's defenses. Pretty handily, in fact. She's going to go here just as soon as Mikshuana's out of the way. But for now... Yeah, thanks for contributing, Rosalina, but... Yeah. Hmm. This could turn out to be... Well, that. She should be safe here. Oh yeah, healing. Yeah, see? Oh, 
But this is largely good news in that it forces Kaurin's HP down into the regions where he's most powerful. Okay. Jesus Christ. I hate reflect. Uh, well, healing. Not yet. Who else can I effectively deploy here? Thanks to his ridiculously high magic defense, magic attack, most of my tanks aren't going to be useful. right hmm, how's he doing he's doing quite well actually hmm okay now he's not doing so well Was I not paying attention and he healed himself somehow or what? Okay, fool me. In theory. Wait a minute. Why is he defending? He ran himself out of SP already? What do his things cost? Yeah, 14 SP. He's out. Okay, just in case. Full mail. That's about right. Ah, no, sorry. This goes to Mikshuana. We still have sex scenes to see. Here we go. Ooh, nice. Physical attack, magic attack, magic defense, and luck. Well, there are better level ups, but that one is perfectly respectable. Hmm. Spirit Castle's necklace. Hmm. Sounds like one of those accessories. So that was that. Let's take a look at our new item. Here it is. Wow. Plus one to all of your elementals except physical. It can't be improved, but I mean, that's pretty impressive. Still, that'll be enough for now. I've already done a couple long, quite long videos in a row. So, thanks for watching and I will see you next time.